10th chapter applications of derivatives this chapter belongs to mathematics 1b part 36 last part completed in bonded seven marks problem completed today also we once again explained seven marks problem by using similar method similar model what is the problem find the maximum area find the maximum area of the rectangle that can be formed find the maximum area of the rectangle that can be formed with the fixed perimeter 20 here fixed perimeter is given first what is the meaning of rectangle rectangle having opposite sides are equal opposite sides are equal diagonal sides here opposite sides here x is here x here y here y here opposite sides are equal diagonal are equal that is called a rectangle in this rectangle suppose this is length this is width first of all you can write the solution length length of the rectangle length of the rectangle is x and width of the rectangle width of the rectangle length of the rectangle is x breadth of the rectangle you have to take y this is length this is breadth after that given that given that fixed perimeter fixed perimeter of rectangle fixed perimeter of rectangle is equal to 20 what is the perimeter of the rectangle is formula is there perimeter of the rectangle formula 2 into length plus breadth 2 into length plus breadth this is a formula of the perimeter of the rectangle formula this is a formula of the perimeter 2 into n plus b also be correct e in this formula 2 1s are 2 tens you can write length what is the length here length is x plus breadth is y is equal to 10 here x plus y equal to 10 that is the first condition but first condition completed here you can use the rectangle figure in this figure you can length and width some value you have to take after that perimeter of the rectangle formula we can write that perimeter you can equal to 20 you will one condition after that area of the rectangle formula area of the rectangle what is the formula area of the rectangle area of the rectangle is equal to length into breadth length into breadth this is the area of the rectangle here area of the rectangle is equal to here x length is what here length is x and breadth is y length is x and breadth is y after that this function you have to take put the area of the rectangle equal to f of x area of the rectangle equal to f of x equal to a equal to x into y here function f of x is a here in this function x by both values is a that's why that's why one implies what is the value of y x plus y equal to 10 x plus y equal to 10 what is the value of y y equal to 10 minus x this is equation but in equation 3 substituted in equation 2 you get constants equation 3 substituted in equation 2 see students area of the rectangle formula you can write x into y that x into y function you can write any one function f of x but function f of x nothing but all of symptoms of x but here y is there that's why in this condition you can write y value is 10 minus 6 after that substituted you get cross x 2 in plus your of x is equal to x into x into y value is what should I say y value is 10 minus 6 then f of x equal to you can write 10 into x 10 x 10 into 10 into x 10 x x into minus x you can write minus x square this is equation number 4 understood or not in this way understood or not this is a very very important repeated problem in IP examination students 
very very easy very easy problem just to, you know that pixel perimeter of the triangle rectangle formula and the area of the rectangle formula just to do formulas you know total you can solve the problem next to derivative in equation 4 derivative 1 both side with respect to x what is the derivative d by dx of f of x is equal to here 10 comma 10 comma d by dx of x minus here d by dx of x square what is the derivative of the form x the form x derivative is f dash x is equal to 10 into x derivative is 1 derivative of x is 1 minus x square derivative is 2x 10 f dash x is equal to 10 minus 2x this is suppose 4 completed we have to take equation number 5 one condition is there write down that condition what is that condition students the condition the condition that the function that the function f of x is maximum or minimum f of x is maximum or minimum then f dash x is equal to 0 this is a very very important point very very key point of in this problem this is a turning point this is a turning point already explained definition here f dash x equal to 0 what is the value of f dash x f dash x value is 10 minus 2x equal to 0 here f dash x value is 10 minus 2x equal to 0 then 10 is equal to 2 into x then x is equal to 2 1 or 2 by the x value is 5 you get x value only one x value previous part problem previous part problem having two y values here only one value is getting that is x value is 5 after that in equation 5 derivative 1 both side with respect to x once again once again derivative here derivative of f dash x is equal to derivative of 10 minus 2 comma derivative of x here you can write f dash x derivative is f double dash x is equal to derivative of constant 10 at the point constant 0 minus 2 comma derivative of x is 1 f double dash x equal to you get minus 2 this is equation number 6 you can write f double dash x value is minus 2 that is equation number 6 after that in equation 6 in equation 6 substituted in equation 6 substituted x is equal to 5 x is equal to 5 you get 1 understood or not friends sir first problem on board 7 marks local maximum and local minimum problems same process first you can find f of x after that f dash x f dash x value equal to 0 after that you can find x value after that one second derivative of f dash x you get f double dash x that to value substituted the f double dash x you get that that is less than 0 or greater than 0 check that's why you can write maximum or minimum. Same process, all problems. Here, x value 5 substitute in this equation. 6 implies f double dash of 5 equal to. Here, minus 2 is there. Here, minus 2 is constant function, students. Minus 2 is constant function. In this minus 2 constant function, x value you can get any value. That is always constant. That's why you can get minus 2. Minus 2 is less than 0 or greater than 0. Less than 0. Less than 0 meaning what here? Maximum value. Therefore, therefore, the function f of x. What is the meaning of f of x here? f of x meaning what here? Area of the triangle. That means the function f of x or area of the area of the rectangle. This function f of x. This function f of x. Let the area of the triangle already explained. Area of the triangle, area of the rectangle is maximum. Is maximum at the x is equal to 5. This area of the rectangle is maximum at the x value equal to 5. This x is equal to 5. If x is equal to 5, substituted in equation number 3, you get 3 implies y equal to 10 minus x, x value is 5, 10 minus x value 5, y equal to 10 minus 5, how much? 5, 
you take 5 x value is 5 and uh, y value also be 5 x value 5 and y value also be 5 then you can find the maximum area right next to maximum therefore maximum area of the rectangle here we can find in this way just 6 marks, 1 mark loss, 1 mark you can compulsory find the maximum area of the rectangle a is equal to x into y. What is the value of a? Here a is the area of the rectangle. What is the value of x? What is the value of x? x value is 5. What is the value of y? I value of y. Then a is equal to 25. Therefore, maximum area of the, this rectangle is 25 square units. You can write units that is square units. Like, like this, 25 also be correct answer. In this way, you can do that. This problem, this problem is very, very important. Repeated problem, neatly explained. This problem, that's why you can practice also be similar way. You get easily understood, easily coming to the problem total ID examination.